Where did the blanket go? It's probably in the trash can or something. In the trash? I, it wasn't like, it was still in my truck. Okay. Cool. We thought we saw some GPS where you had stopped by near construction oh. a roll off dumpster. Is that true? or? I think, yeah, I think that's like, I dumped my clothes in there. So that would have been on the way back to the house. Yeah. In my neighborhood? Yeah. When the officer came out of the zone. Okay. Was it one of those red construction dumpsters? More than likely. Did you pack new clothes? How did that work? I already have some in there because, like, in case we have, like, a spill or something. Oh. If you ever get crude oil on you, you know. Yeah, I, had, I, like, I have, like, new, I have, like, two pairs of boots and uh, all kinds of different stuff in there just because, like, like, this one time I had to have a spill and that defrost on, and I had, like, a headache for, like, two weeks because, oh. like, the crude oil that comes with like, that. So I always have some in there. So where did you keep them after you took them off? Like, did you just change out there into your new... Other uh, clothes? So, like, I, I dumped my clothes in that dumpster. But that wasn't that on the way back? When you were coming? Like, you had already worked the whole day, yeah. right? Yeah, I'd work, no. well, I'd work, like, till, like, 11 or so. 11. Yeah. So, it was back when, well, when Nicole Atkinson... Yeah, when she was at yeah, the house, hit the yeah. doorbell, that's right. when I knew from out of the house. Right. Okay, guys. I'm wondering why he needed to change his clothes. What was the purpose of that? Would he have oil on them? I mean, just from opening the lids and dropping them down in? I mean, what was the purpose? That he would throw his clothing away and he would change out of his clothing at the oil site at Serbi 319, proceed to put new clothes on. I mean, those are his family members. Wouldn't, I mean, their fiber or DNA would be on his clothing just from him being around them and him living with them on a daily basis. So why is it that he had to change out of his clothes and throw them away? Not only change, but throw them in a dumpster. What are your thoughts? What do you think he threw them away? I mean, there wasn't any blood involved with this murder. It was a suffocation and a smothering, so I don't understand why the need for throwing them away. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Okay, guys. In loving memory of Shanann, Bella, Celeste, and Nico.